It's Monday, July 30th, 2007, and you're watching The Ointment. I'm Steve Tatum, and I want to wish our Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger a happy 60th birthday. It's the big 6-0, so it's no longer I'll be back. Now it's I've got a sore back. Our top story, Britain's new Prime Minister Gordon Brown is visiting the United States this week. That's because his predecessor, Tony Blair, told him, that's where you go to pick up your orders. Vice President of the United States, Dick Cheney over the weekend had a successful heart operation where he had some artificial parts that helped pump his heart replaced. Yeah, in case you didn't know it, Dick Cheney is a cyborg. And what I want to know is, can we trade him in for parts? Our congratulations go out to the nation of Iraq. They won a big soccer tournament over there in Asia over the weekend and they're celebrating like crazy. That is until George Bush figures out a way for them to lose the tournament. And he's having a hard time because the tournament's over, but it's not going to stop him. The Liberal Political Action Committee MoveOn.org is organizing a boycott of advertisers that try to sell their products on Fox News. And I'm all for this. I say, don't advertise on Fox News. What you really ought to do is advertise on the ointment. I'll take your money. The equivalent of the Chinese Food and Drug Administration is in a lot of turmoil because as it turns out, a lot of the food over in China is poisonous. So they're going to work with the uh, Chinese Tourism Board to try to improve their image. And they have a new slogan. It goes like this. China, come for the food, stay because you're dead. And finally in entertainment news, Lindsay Lohan's new horror film was a huge bomb over the weekend. The film is called I Know Who Killed Me. The answer apparently is Jack Daniels. Now watch this and tell me if you don't agree with me that this is just clips from Lindsay Lohan's personal life. She's living inside a world she made up. You should be dead by now. That's the ointment for another day. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Steve Tatum and that's news. We'll catch you tomorrow everybody.